Good morning. The thing that is on my mind is a hot topic for me, and that is the topic of self-promotion. I have been coached so many times in my corporate career not to be self-promoting. I've had women leaders primarily call me out on shining my light too bright, asking questions in a way that's incredibly articulate, but makes other people in the room feel stupid. Yes, I actually received that coaching. <laughs> and it really came home to me when one of my business besties shared with me that she received feedback from a fellow entrepreneur that she thought promoting her business on social media was gauche. Very disturbing feedback. Here's the thing. When we are rising in our careers, when we are building our businesses, if we don't talk about the value that we have to deliver, the value we have to offer, what makes us special and different from other businesses or people in our fields, we are not going to rise, not to the heights that we can rise to. And I have to tell you, I never hear men being coached to stop self-promoting to stop sharing their accomplishments. It seems to me that it is always women who are shamed or uh, try to shame us into not shining our lights as brightly as we can. And I want to encourage you to shine your light bright. When people tell you to stop self-promoting or you shouldn't be sharing so much on social media, do it more because that means you are getting attention, you are showcasing your results, your achievements, and the value you have to deliver. Now, of course, we're going to temper that with not taking credit that's not ours, with not giving guarantees or claims that are not true. Stand in your light and share what makes you amazing, because this is how we rise.